welcome back to the channel. In the last episode, we left you just as we were about to walk around the town of Boulogne. Right, we are. Yeah. So, what do you want to do then? Do the crypt first? Yeah. <clears throat> Let's go and do the crypt. Boulogne was once the major Roman port for trade with Britain. The town was occupied by the English numerous times due to conflict between England and France, but the French eventually took it back for good. This is the Basilica of Notre Dame, but unfortunately we can't see it very well due to all the scaffolding. I assume the chunks out of the wall was caused during the Second World War. We'll go into the Basilica later, but first we'll take a look down into the crypt. Here you can go straight on to go into the Basilica or we turn left down to the crypt. So that was the result, it's only two euros on the first Sunday of every month. Mm, okay. Normally it's five euros per person. Now I have to be honest, this was not what I was expecting. I always thought it was going to be tunnels full with skulls and bones but actually it was uh, a bit more like a museum really. The crypt is believed to be the longest in France at 128 meters long. Apparently these Romanesque columns date back to the 11th century. I imagine they've been moved here from somewhere else. Legend has it that this statue of the Virgin and Child was carried in on a boat in 636 by angels and revealed the existence of a treasure trove that was to be used for the construction of a church. Nice one. There's a floor plan here, reminds me of the Da Vinci Code. Here lies many bodies from the French Revolution. very well but once you've seen a bit of old masonry you've seen it really glad we got to see a service in the basilica after that it's time for a little bit of lunch we decided to give this crepery a try so have you decided what you're having yeah i'm gonna have a um, savory one with chicken i think Cheese, chicken, onions, and cider. Mm, that sounds nice. What are you having? I'm going to have the Normand, which is with apples, yeah. butter, and caramel, and with Calvados flambe. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't you the one? Okay, let's see what that's like. They were busy, so it took a while for them to come out and take our order. 
What do you think the crit then? That's what I was expecting. I no. thought it would be more rough and ready. And I thought it was going to be full of skulls and bones. Yes, yeah, and graves and tombs. Mm. Really, it was more like a museum. Museum, yeah. 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 And very difficult to tell whether you were looking at original or yeah. I think, reproduction. I think it was all original and what had been discovered, like all the wall paintings and everything. Yeah. Two euros, it was worth it. Yeah. How much is it normally, do you know? It's normally five euros per person. Yeah. So that's an offer. By fluke, we came on Bargain. the first Sunday of the month. Bargain. Yeah. How long do we give him before we clutter off? Here he comes. Bonjour, monsieur. Vous êtes trois? Est-ce que vous voulez vous installer là-bas plutôt? The novelty is beginning to wear off for me. So in France, this is a big coffee. It's not though, is it? Well, we know the truth, don't uh, we? This is a Café Grand. Yeah. So compare that to Starbucks. So what do I ask for for when I ask for... I want a really big one. <laughs> Très Grand. Très Grand. <laughs> Well, I don't think I'll put two sugars in this because no. it might be a bit too sweet. Caramel. A picture of your caramel. I changed my mind, decided to go sweet rather than savoury. One, two, three. Beautiful. Mm. Merci. Mm. 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 Merci. Careful with that beer. Hot. Ooh. Is it coming? It looks tasty. Oh, I smell that. Calvados. <laughs> I should be drunk. Yeah. Mm. Alcoholic. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's freezing. Sounds a bit chilly, didn't it? Yeah. Hen party. Hen, hen party. party. That's quite a lot of hens, isn't it? Yeah. It's an old chemist. Yeah. Big Yeah, it was, it was all right. <laughs> Nothing special. Nothing special, if I'm honest. Yeah. It's just getting the ambiance, though, isn't it? Too righty. Yeah. There wasn't much of that either. <laughs> These serpents are the legs for a bench. Oh, these are what the seats should look like. Right, I'm coming down off these walls because you can't see that much. Here's a rare view. There's a lot of work being done on the basilica. Yeah. Oh, blimey, don't slip here. You'd only do it once, <laughs> wouldn't you? Well, I might have had a caramel crepe, but I'm absolutely starving still. So we're on the hunt now for a kebab. You got the kebab? One kebab. Oh, you're not having anything? No. Oh dear, is your crepe too enough for you? Yeah. Um, I was starving. Okay, yeah, busy, what did you say? Yeah, busy little place, very popular, and loads of um, Uber Eats for delivery. Oh, I see, right. Yeah. Okay, right, got somewhere in mind. Good. It's a sim better day, isn't it? On the left here. Yeah. Right mess. Falling to bits. It's a view over to the port here. Oh, wow. Yeah. There's the old fort, but we're not going in. No. Oh, I thought the road was blocked then. We're just car using park. their car park. No camping car. Is that what it said? Yeah. No camping cars allowed. We're going to 
lots of way to stop that much. Yeah, that's what they're us. Do you want to turn around for a bit of you? Oh, you are picky, aren't you? Tell me afterwards. It's always better once I've parked already to require the other view. All right, I'm going to park here. View of the lighthouse. The kebab is absolutely delicious. Good. Enjoying it. Mmm. Top dollar. Got the old tarp up because it's a bit sunny. This is what would you do it long ways? I don't I don't mind which way we do it. It's, I just picked up the first end I came across. That's grim out there now, yeah. isn't it? Very, very exposed here though, aren't we? Yeah. Oh, I haven't got the uh, camera. Just get this going. Go out again. <laughs> Beauty of filmmaking, Charlie. Okay, let's get this all working. Okay, Chutney Brown, are we ready? Okay, yeah. This is a nice little park up for the afternoon. Yeah, if the weather's not too grim, it's a really nice uh, spot. <laughs> taught me a lesson. I should have grabbed my drone flight. As soon as I got here, yeah. Really, no I? matter how tired you are, no tired. grab it while you can. Yeah. Here you wait. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's a rubbish bin, but it's a bit yeah, full. Yeah, it's really full. Yeah. On the really lookout for another one. There. So there was an old fort there. Yeah. Well, that's mm. what I was. Yeah. I meant to film. Reminds you of um, New Haven Fort. Back yeah. Home. Very similar designs. Yeah. Second World War bunker, isn't it? Yeah. Off here. Yeah, coming off. That's a bit dangerous conditions now. Yeah. Isn't it? Nasty. I'm far more cautious of these deer signs now. Following that. Experience. The other day. The other day, yeah. yeah. We just saw one in the field back there, didn't we? Yeah, so don't want one to run out in front of us again. Uh, they've got flashing lights on their uh, come out the front. See how they got flashing lights on their on their chevrons, chevrons. to mark the bend. They're very effective, aren't they? Yeah, especially in this weather. Yeah. Very much in use. So it's just parking anywhere here. in here, yeah. Okay. Oh, there's bins. Are they? Oh, they just recycling. Just there's a bin over there. Should we go yeah, and make we use of it? Bin. bin here. Yeah, that green bin. Oh, there's one in there as well. Good. It's a nice oh, building, maybe isn't that, it? Maybe that's the, that must that be the must festival. Be the hall. Yeah. Oh, so we park uh, away from it. Quite posh. Yeah. I think it, yeah. they used to generate power or something. Yeah, look at the chimney. Yeah, it's amazing. We tucked ourselves in down at the opposite end to the hall, just in case they've got any functions on tonight. Sounds like there's some shooting going on somewhere. 
so you've weakened. Yeah, I need to have something to settle my stomach from all that Calvados <laughs> and sugar. <laughs> oh dear. There's your butty. Delicious. It's your favourite, isn't it? Ham and cheese. This is ham and couscous. Yeah, what a weird combination. We've been in this car park about half an hour now and it's nice and peaceful. There was a wedding on down at that big building that we showed you, but they've all cluttered off now. And we just had a nice cheese and ham and French bread for our tea. We were supposed to be going out to get some chips. Yeah, we were, but to have egg and chips and ham. Ham, egg and chips, but after that long foggy drive we couldn't be bothered, road, could we? For about 50 minutes, we couldn't be bothered. No. What have you got in your hand there then, Charlie? So we just made do with ham and cheese sandwich. <clears throat> and now I have got this coconut, looks like a frangipan and raspberry. Can you keep the thing still? You keep, I keep trying to focus on it, you keep moving it to a new position. And you said you'd just have one of your yogurts. And yeah, but I, I changed could get my mind I now. Wanted, but I'm prepared to share it with you. Well, that's very decent of you. I'll have some of that, please. But I don't need to have half. Because I know you probably want the whole thing. Oh, I'll give you a small half. A small half. <laughs> that sounded like a brick. Mm. What's it like? Right up my street. It's delicious. Any cakes right up your mm. street. Mmm. Mmm. Lovely. Good. I'll try it now. Mmm. It's not bad. Bit gooey, isn't it? Do you like goo? Yes. Mm. I'm going to give her the rest of mine. Later. Give it to the person that enjoys it the most, I say. Mm -hmm. Do you want your yogurt now? No. I'm done. Mm -hmm. Right, we're going to settle down in a minute. I watch a load of YouTube. Mm. Everybody's posted, haven't they? Sunday, so it's mega watch day. Mega watch day. Yeah. Right, we're going to end this vlog here, I think. Thanks for watching. And if you haven't already done so, then please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more adventures from the Little Red Camper. In the next episode, I think we're visiting La Coupoule, which was one of the underground lairs of the Nazi V2 rocket.